Morning. Welcome to Thursday, the 11th of February. And uh, beautiful shapes here on this tree, fallen tree with snow. Lovely. Well, listen, the headline today, is this not right, Brewer? Headline today, it's cold. I think um, the forecast has us at minus five at the moment. We're just after, not long after seven o'clock. And it's supposed to be something like minus five, minus six-ish. Which, uh, compared to some places in the, in the country, is nothing. I mean, uh, some places yesterday had minus 17 or something like that. I don't know. But uh, it's cold. And, uh, and so I'm going to keep this short and sweet because I've got my hands out to film this and uh, I can feel them losing the sensation of, uh, in them as we speak. So, onward and upward. Um, you may read today an uh, incredible fact. I actually came up yesterday in a Radio 4 programme, a bit of a fan of Radio 4 me, uh, called More or Less, which um, unusually for me focuses on statistics. I'm not a, I think I've said to you before, I'm not really a numbers person, but focuses on statistics and statistics can be fascinating even if you don't particularly understand how they're produced but anyway this uh, this statistic um it's been produced by a math expert from uh, bath university a chap called uh is it kit yates yeah kit yates um anyway it's his thing and as i say you may have heard this is a single can of coke would be enough to contain all the COVID-19 causing virus that's currently circulating in the world. Now just think about that. A single can that would normally contain Coke could contain all of the COVID-19 virus that is at this exact moment circulating in the world. So this chap, Kit Gates, as I say, he has worked out that there are around <laughs> two quintillion now, quintillion is apparently um, two billion billion SARS, COV2 virus particles in the world at any one time. That's amazing, isn't it? Really is quite, quite amazing um, to think that this, this thing that has brought the world largely to a standstill, so small, that you can contain all of them in a little can of coke. In a perfect world, I would have found a can of coke, of course, and popped it in uh, in the snow for you to look at, but um, I'm not really a coke drinker, so I don't have a can of coke at home, but I wish I had. But uh, next time you see a can of coke, just think about that. Quite amazing. What is it, is it? The devil's in the detail. A lot of people, of course, prefer to say God is in the detail. And that is true, but I think maybe in this case, ooh, the devil is in the detail. You have a good Thursday. Have a good day. If you're out and about, wrap up, put your gloves on, because uh, it is mighty cold. But uh, enjoy it. It is, as my granny would have said, good healthy weather. Good weather to get out for a walk if you can. Take care, folks. Be good to yourself, as ever. Be kind to yourself as always. And uh, from Brewer and me on a beautiful start to what is going to be, I think, a beautiful day. God bless. Brewy! You're not talking to me today. Oh, heaven knows what I've done. Maybe I should go and get Olive and Mabel.